Hello everyone and welcome to a new game I'm going to be trying. This is Teleglitch and I am just screwing around with controls and stuff. Future rotate, view zoom, info, monitors, blah blah blah. So yeah, my friend Bormac told me I should try this game out. So we're going to try it and we're probably going to get our butts kicked, but whatever. In we go. We were working on a master teleporter that could transport you anywhere to unlimited distances, but something went wrong. Something came through from the other side. First, we thought it was a minor glitch, but it quickly turned to a nightmare. The facility AI became aggressive, and the military robots turned against us. The space of the complex started warping. Rooms and hallways randomly reorganized themselves as if they followed some twisted pattern. I decided to seal myself in here and wait for help. I've been hiding out here for weeks, but nobody came, and I'm running out of food. My only chance is if I use the regular teleporter the facility to get to the master teleporter, and then teleport myself back to Earth. Okay, so I have no idea what I'm doing. I literally installed this game about four minutes ago. I played the tutorial, and now I'm here. So we are green block. Oh, there's a thing here. Empty can. Pick up empty can. Yeah. Empty can. I have a little bit of explosives. I learned in the tutorial I can combine explosives, but I don't see why I would. I have 45 shots with my little uh, pistol. I have 44 shots with my little pistol. Uh, what do we have here? Empty can. Pick up empty can. Okay, can I combine empty cans? No. Okay, um, nothing else here. As you see, um, the way the lighting works, it's really cool. See, your view area is based on what you can see. So I'm doing this. Oh, and you can push the boxes around. It's kind of cool, I suppose. Um, I'm just kind of, like, worried about robots. There's a lot of junk on the floor. Can I go in the tube? I can, but there's nothing in the tube. Uh, I can hide under these. I guess that's cover. Oh, these rocks. I don't know if I can shoot through them or not. Um, it's cool. You move slower when you're aiming. I'm, like, really worried about, like, uh, deadly robots. Oh, I don't have my gun out. That's kind of a bad thing. There. Now I have my gun out. You can see that little gray pixel there. Ooh, and you can look really far. Um, okay, so this... That's obviously blocked. Let's see what happens this way. Definitely hearing something over there. Let's uh, peek over. Oh, what? What? Why am I hearing noises? Oh, so I guess that's some of the warpy contagiony stuff. Something there. I don't like it. Ah, uh, hi. Uh, spooky distortion, gooey stuff. Okay, so we know the bullets don't hurt it. Not really smart. Ooh, I can talk to this thing. Hi. Teleporter location marked on map. Yeah, that's where I started. Is that where I started with the teleporter? I don't know. Maybe I can tell. What the hell was that? No, no, seriously. What the hell was that? Um... Beep. Beep. Yeah. Oh god, what is it? What is it? I gotta kill it. Get, get, get. Gooey thing. Hi. You also have a can. Is there another one? It dropped a can. You didn't drop anything. Um. Is there the door there? Hallway here. Just a little. Up a. Are they robots? Are they bugs? There's one. Die! Okay, well, there we go. A little door there. Oh, why is why is the whole room spinning, making me dizzy? Another door there. Uh, ooh, this is complicated already. Three doors. I've never thought I'd find three doors. What, what the... Oh god, oh god, oh god. I think he's too big for the door. Yeah. Oh, no, no, he is, he is, he's not, he's not. Oh, oh. He's dead. Is this machine making noise? Because it's making a lot of noise. I don't like it. I killed the big guy. So I guess I'm doing okay. I am down to 28 rounds. Uh, hello, computer. Secret hall. This facility contains the rooms that are quickly walled off. That resulting in damage looking all the things we destroyed at range weapons. 
You see, everyone's so getting useful equipment, including weapons. Okay, so you gotta look for damaged walls. I saw those in the tutorial. There's a box at the door. Um, anything hidden in here? Something? That just might be what they were talking about. Um, let's see. If I take this is RDX 250. It's not explosive. So I saw that. Um, that didn't seem to work. Let's try it with some bullet. That doesn't seem to work either, and it's wasted. Very expensive. Box. Hello, box. What's in here? Bullet. More explosives. And a bullet for a gun I don't have yet. You have more bullets. Um, more explosives. And a different kind of gun. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Can dog come by? What did I just do? Oh, I just made more RDX. Made something called PV Faust. Item inventory up. Can I go to... Here, let's see. I want to know what I just made. Uh, 9mm, a good semi, good and small numbers, blah, blah, blah. I just made an item. Empty can. Two empty can times RDX with PD Faust. Uh, MG, that's a gun I don't have. PD Faust, disposable lot rocket launcher, one shot only. Okay! I made a rocket launcher. And also my inventory is all messy. I think if I hit E, I can, yeah. But I can't combine those. Okay. Let's put the explosives all down here. I can still get to them, just the same, but it's just that. Um, PD Faust. Empty can. What do I... I can't combine these? I can't use both at once? That sucks. Uh, let's see. Let's continue on our way. Ah! Suck, dude. Okay, so I came in here for this. Celtech, one of the largest military focused corporations in the modern world, from organic supplies, production, and even strategic operations on the battlefield. Militech employs over one billion personnel from all over known space and is predicted to own at least five percent of the total resources of whole human civilization. Do I want to try uh let's let's try this. Get close enough to the wall to actually do something this time. Okay. Oh, wow. Hey, it didn't hurt didn't break this wall, though. That wall looks really explodable. Huh, they're seeing this way? No, I don't seem to be able to go that way. Um, let's go back to the gun. Uh, there was other ways to go. Um, oh, there was a door over that way I missed. But I don't care. I'm gonna go this way, because I want to see what's over here. I expect more death robots. Ah, big death robot! Trying to conserve ammo. There we go. Didn't drop anything, you bitch. Hey, a box. What are you? More gun, more explosives. Shotgun and rifle ammo. How much? I have ten rounds for the shotgun. Let us save that. Yes. Ooh, it's weird. Look at, see, I love how that, like, your line of sight is controlled by this. It's pretty cool. Although I don't like how there's nothing here. Although, for some reason, this yellow... Oh, I'm going to waste so much of my explosives. Oh, I actually thought that the walls opened that time. I don't know. I really don't know what explosive walls look like. Why do these people expect me to know what I'm doing? I don't know. Why are you watching this? The teleportation technology. Short-range teleportation was achieved with the help of a brilliant particle physicist and brain surgeon, Dr. Edwin Schmerzoff. Teleportation had always been held by, back by the requirements of hyper-difficult mathematical complications which were needed for calculating each teleportation jump. Dr. Schmerzhoff finally solved the problem by copying the structure of human brain cells and using it as a calculation hardware blueprint for the device. The limit of teleportation range is determined by the single fact that each kilometer of extra distance makes the required calculations exponentially more difficult. That is a pretty cool way of doing things, I suppose. Um, okay. Ah! 
You bitch. Oh, you scared me. You actually scared me. You're... Oh. Dude, he wasn't even guarding... Oh, what? I feel bad now, because I didn't... There wasn't even any re... Wish the door would crush you to death. Ah! I learned... Oh, oh hey, that guy. Oh, there's a new guy. What the hell are you? Monster database updated. Monsters. Bio unit M3, large mutant. Bio unit M1, mutant. Reactivated organic unit, type 1 zombie. Oh, so that was a Zambo. I couldn't really tell. It was just, you know, green pixels coming at me. Up, 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 up. Oh, nice. To, up, up, up. You just zoomed past me. I don't know what that was about. Oh, you had an empty cannon. Dude, sometimes it's like... Stop punching me! Sometimes it really feels like, you know, I'm aiming, like, right at it. Like, this little line is over them. But it's like, look, if you look, my, my shots aren't perfect. I don't have, like, good accuracy. So it kind of screws me over. Uh, let's go up this big hall. Hey, it's distortion. I kind of want to touch you. Hi! I want to touch you. Okay, I'm not really that dumb. Almost. Another blocked way. So, they said, didn't they say, well, was it that blocked stuff with rubble? No, no. I have wasted many much ammos. Also, I should have whipped that shotgun out when that guy was, like, punching me in the head over and over again. Would have made a lot of sense. What are you? You're nothing. Haha! -ha! And another one that's just blocked up. What the hell? Oh, this is all derples. Going down the hall. Robot. 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 Hmm. Robot. Oh god. Run, 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 run. Shotgun. Holy crap! Holy crap! New monster. What the hell was that? Oh, uh, no. Aha! Giant zombie. Unit type heavy. The necrotic tissue activation is a big success. No. Done with that. Not reading all that crap about Zambos. Okay, but it's a Zambo. Shotgun versus Zambo. Good deal. Need to find another room full of... Ammo. Tube! Hello, Tube. We're friends now, Tube, aren't we? Uh, I could make a Poozy Foost. Why the hell not? Poozy Foost. Whatever the hell. Computer? Oh, I can't do anything with computer. Oh, hello, thing. The Facility AI-1. The Facility AI was originally designed to be nothing more than a good administration system, but you know what's the thing about any intelligence? It evolves. That's not true. I mean, my brother is technically intelligent, and I haven't seen him evolve. It is unpredictable, because it becomes something that was not... that it was not before. After a while, the AI learned so much, it started helping us out with other things besides administration. It researched new weapons, helped build robots, and even designed architecture for new facility buildings. That's actually really lazy of them. You, it's like... I don't feel like doing paper. Like, let's make a cyborg brain do it for us. And then it's like, oh, no one thought it was odd that it started, you know, making buildings and designing ways to kill people. And <sighs> That door back there. I missed that door back there. Oh, this is backtracking and it's boring. And I'm not very fast. I already searched there. Yes, I did. Okay, I go all the way back there. And there's a thing there. Why is there a thing highlighted? Did I miss something back there? I guess that's supposed to be a tree. Yeah, it says there's a thing here. I already... Oh. Empty? Yeah, you're empty. Organics garden. I wonder if stuff respawns. I don't like that machine. So I did search here. Also, it's saying this. Oh, wait. Did I actually find something this time? <laughs> ha ha! I actually figured it out. Oh. Oh, no. Am I really going to have to use all my explosives? No, I'll come back. I might get explosives in this room here. 
shortcut of the room here I didn't explore. Zombies! Oh. Okay, using my last explosive. Super tube. Happy explosion day, gorgeous. <gasps> it's a doodad. It's a thing. Um, what I get? I don't know. Um, med kit. Med kit twenty-five. Tube. Something grenades. Nail box. Okay, so um, I'm going to actually use this, right? I can use it with left click. Yes, and now I'm at 98 health. And did I get more shotgun shells? I did get more shotgun shells. That's good. What, what, what? Where the hell did you come from? And I can't combine my doodads. Nail box. A box of nails. Sharp. Well, I'd hope they'd be sharp. Okay, well, that was a good backtracking, I suppose. Although it says I got grenades, and I don't know how to use grenades. Grenade, 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 no, 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 nail box. Apparently there's many ways to combine nail boxes. Thingy with bullets and med kicks. X grenades. Can I click them? I can't click them. But I got them. I don't know what to Maybe it's in control, and I just didn't controls. Great, 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 no, no, no. Don't say anything about grenades in there. Ah, uh, let's go left. Stupid robot. Stupid other robot. They make wiggly noises. I don't like it. Dude, you totally, like, lap me. What do you get? Another can? Another crappy can? I want another can! Why are these robots made of cans? Out of the way, CanBot! No, don't punch me, CanBot! Hi. Planet Medusa 1C. Small, almost Earth-side planet with no significant resources and far from colonized space. Its planetary stock price was incredibly low, making it the perfect spot for Militech research. Being far from any settlements gave an added bonus of reduced distraction for scientists in the facility. The planet's surface features extremely high temperatures, deadly radiation, and poisonous atmosphere. This means all personnel should stay inside the research facility. Exiting facility without ac adequate protective equipment is instantly fatal. Standard supply drops... Two facilities are performed every five months by automatic transport ships. Current status. All operations abandoned due to negative profit outlook. Planet Medusa 1C quarantined indefinitely. So I am stuck. Well, that sucks. Hey, thing. What's in here? More guns. Uh, I can't read. Oh, more explosives. Um, some shells. And a bit gun. Well, that's cute. That really wasn't a lot of bullets, but okay. And I don't actually... Oh, I got ten more rounds of the shotgun. I am not very good at aim, but I'm doing okay. Nailbox, again. I always feel like I take the wrong way when I take the choice. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Bitch. Down to twelve rounds. Um, yes. dead end now, um, there's at least one more way to go, running low on bullets, but I'd really, I'd, I'd almost want to, oh, haha, -ha! you tried, you failed, haha, -ha, and you tried twice, wiggly stuff, wiggly stuff, you make so much noise, wiggly stuff, oh, I can tell this is explosive good stuff, uh, okay, we'll be back for you. I've wasted so many- Ah! What the hell was that about? Why did this look like? No, there's gotta be... 
Did I miss something? Um, no. Oh, there is, yeah, I did. I missed the door that way. Okay, good. I was about to say, they wouldn't just make you need an explosive, would they? That wall looks different. Why does that wall look different? I kind of want to explode it. They can't all be explosive walls, though. Oh, I'm going to waste so many explosives trying to figure out what the hell I'm doing. Oh, and then it twists and gives me motion sickness, and I'm down to five bullets. With more wiggly stuff. Aha! You tried! Ha! Ah. Three bullets. Wiggly stuff. Hello. Teleglitch base time anomaly. Initial analysis and right. These blobs of black and colorful anomaly seems to be the only result of taste pairs for the limited range teleportation. We have been investigating this phenomenon for the past two hours and think it might have profound implications for theoretical physics. The blackness seems to be literally an inside-out space-time curvature and opens a range of possibilities for research. My colleague has already suggested we could weaponize it by capturing the field into super-intense wave and pressure containers to be used for planetary bombardment. Oh, and if you touch it, your brain explodes. Okay, so it was good that I didn't touch it before. Even though I really want to. Oh, also, for some reason, this one has a fence around it because they're nice like that. Because after they tell me my brain will explode from touching it, I need to be protected from touching it. This game knows me too well. Nembo? Nembo? Sneaky hiding on the door? No. I mean, I heard you. Heard you. One bullet. Almost not worth keeping this gun out. Anything? Storage cabinets marked on map. Um... Storage cabinets marked on map. Where? Oh, there. Storage cabinets. Good. I guess those are important somehow. Where are you at? Where are you? I heard you. There you are. Ha! Out of bullets. Ha ha! Don't care. Get over here. Bitch. Okay, we're gonna have fun with the shotgun now. Hey, buddy, now we get to see what I think's funny. Search everything. Yeah, search all that. Okay, good. Where you at? Where you at, buddy? Come on, come on. Oh god, panicking. Shouldn't panic. This is bad. This is bad. Uh. Well. Oh god, that was two bullets wasted. Oh god, oh. I meant to do that? Not really. Aha, how to med kit too! Um, panic, a little bit of panic. A little bit of panic. M-chip, programmable 8-bit microprocessor. That doesn't kill zombos. It really doesn't kill zombos. <laughs> Clip, explosives, shotgun shells. Good. Ah! Ah! No! You bitch. You made me look bad in front of the customers. No to self by scientists. Number 84? Chemistry sector. The standard military can be given to reactivating combatants contains artificial smell enhanced to make the food extremely desirable for the unit. I received information that some guerrilla ar human armies fighting with Militech supplied reactivation have used Militech can meat in combination with improvising to lure Militech soldiers to deadly traps. I request the science to investigate the problem in our product and if need be, change the concept to install new software to reactivate the soldiers and to avoid these kinds of traps. So they've been making Zambos, um, let's see, can gun detector. Ooh. Detector time. 
Wait, no, if I make detector. Now I have a detector. And now it will detect enemy movement in tight little spaces. I can make a nail bomb. I can make a can gun. Or I can make a disposable rocket. I don't want any of these right now. Um, let's see, cancel. Reload. 15 shots is good. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Good. Ah! I'm not completely useless at this. I'm the only place this facility has to save myself. Why was there even a door here? You got my hopes up. I was like, oh, I bet you this. Gotta be something really cool on the other side of this door. Maybe some explosives or another can gun or rocks. Yeah. I'm gonna go over here. There's gonna be a zombie. It's gonna go rare. Shows me what I know. What are you? Nailbox! Times three. Uh, I'm tempting to make a nail bomb, but no. Okay, this is gonna have space monkey zombies. What is that sound? Hello, machines. Can I be friends? There's nothing cool here. I don't like this. Ah! The situation is much worse if it seems that not only have been let loose all over the facility, they are programmed to attack on site. The facility's light support seems to be working, but only in emergency capacity. Almost all weapon locking the floors have been emptied, probably by the zombies. The military body tough one for the center of the military purpose. Life, life clone mutated and rooted for a single nest birth. I bet they're all hungry. D did I explode, or did I get to the second area? Oh. Oh my god, that was the teleporter? I thought there was cool stuff left. I don't get, like, a prompt, like, Would you like to teleport to the next level? It's, no, it's BOOM! Explosions. Press C to continue. S to save and exit. How long has this been going for? Almost a half hour. Not really, but close. Close enough. It says I've been t playing for 20 minutes, plus me jerking around and getting started. I will call that a night. And I will be uploading this, and I'm sure you guys will enjoy watching it. And I apologize that it's all pixely and tiny, but the game itself is pixely and tiny. Hmm. I'm going to try and play some more tomorrow. I only found one of the four secrets. I don't think you want to watch me replaying levels, so I'm just going to pretty much see if I can beat this game. I'm not going to try for 100%, obviously, because, you know, you saw I'm very good at wasting explosives and bullets and panicking. Though they're pretty much the three things that I'm good at. Not really a good resume, but it might be enough to save me from myself and zombies. Anyway, thanks for watching, dudes. I hope you enjoyed. Be sure to watch Bormac. He's the reason I got this game. He's doing a hell of a lot more games than I am, and you might find him interesting. Peace out.